Hi, April and Carl. It's Lee. Hope you're doing well. Uh, did my best to make it out to you guys, and I, I will at some point. Had to babysit today. Say hi, Henry. Hi, Carl. Hi, April. <laughs> he tries to be funny by not saying anything. Anyway, um, yeah, I hope this video finds you well. I'm just going to break down um, how to very simply enter how much you guys are using to get your state credits. Um, should only take a two minute uh, every few months. There are companies that charge to do this stuff. I don't suggest doing that as long as this is very simple for you guys. I'm suggesting everyone do this for you know a, a few months and then try it out. And if it's very simple for you, great. If you wanna pay somebody to do it, then there's lots of companies that do it. You may have, uh, I think we talked about this, you received the email from the company SREC Trade. They just saw that you registered um, as far as you getting solar and now they're marketing to you guys. So it, it's a company that they're not a bad company. Um, I, I can't recommend or suggest any one particular company. Um, Flet Exchange in Jersey City, Flet, F-L-E-T-T. -T, they were selling the credits a year ago. Um, they've been in business a long time. I, I don't know if they're currently selling these new credits because they're new since March of last year and the last I spoke with them, they weren't even sure if they were gonna sell them. Um, but anyway, it's, it's something that if you wanna look into, you can. But as you'll see in this video, it should be very simple for you guys to do. So I'm gonna see if I can point this screen, okay? So you're gonna go to that website that I would sent you. So it's pjm.eis.com. Uh, I don't know if this shows up on a phone, on a computer, shooting. Okay, so, uh, so you go to this website here, you guys have your login, I am, this is a private video just to you guys, um, so it was what, Hux Roof. Mm -mm. Hooks Roof, and then April and Carl One, capital A for April. This should be good. Let's see. And then log in. You can remember it, so it always logs you guys in. One sec while I get us logged in here. Um, it's a, to my knowledge, it's a semi-government organization, right? So this isn't a government organization, but, um, a variety of states use them. So it's, um, you were from Maryland, Ohio, New Jersey, a lot, a lot, a lot of states yeah, use them. Yeah. Okay. Capital April and Carl one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So PJM, uh, GATS, uh, EIS. They they all do the state credits for a variety of uh, of different states. Ohio, New Jersey, um, a, a lot of East Coast states. Um, okay. So once you log in, it's going to give you this page here. All this stuff is very extraneous information. All you're looking for is this green button right here that says entry. So that's where you're entering your usage. Green button right there, entry, yep. Okay. So it's gonna bring you to this page here. We're almost, we're almost uh, dinner's almost ready. And you see we entered for August 1,001 kilowatts. Saturday morning. 814 in September, 707 in July. Anyway, it's a uh, cumulative. So what I actually did was you, you sent me a picture that you had produced on, on your Solar Edge app, 3,410 kilowatts in by December, which means three state credits, okay? So um, let's see, unprocessed. So this is for December. So January... Um, right, February's not over. You can enter them at the end of each month. So January, you can go ahead and enter what your read is. So the last read on your Solar Edge app was 3410. And then you can go ahead and enter your new read. So your new read is probably, I don't know, 
3,710, just because it's January and uh, there's not as much sun during January as there is during August, right? So the winter months, as, as you can clearly see, look, look, August, you produce a thousand kilowatts just in a month. And then December, it estimated you produce 395 kilowatts. These, these numbers here are all based on this 3410 that you've produced since it was turned on in August. Okay, so um, yes, you are going to underproduce in the winter. You're going to be equally producing during the summer. Um, so that would be because, well, winter, first of all, is because there's, there's not as much sunlight. Um, equally producing during the summer because there's a lot of sunlight, but also because most houses are using a lot of electricity for, uh, air conditioning. Now, if you guys have electric heat, then obviously this would be sort of reversed, but you get the point. Okay. And, uh, during the fall and spring, you will be overproducing. You won't be using that much electricity, but you'll be generating a lot from a lot of sunlight during the spring and fall. So that's what you will see with these months throughout the years of how they go up and down and up and down. Okay, in any event, uh, once you type in your meter read date, you'll type in the date and you'll put in whatever today is. It doesn't even let you choose today. It'll let you choose up to February 15th. If you enter it, uh, to my understanding, before the 15th, you will get paid the following month, um, possibly two months from, from what I'm, I'm gathering, although I'll include the info for the TREC, which is the state credit, uh, the TREC administrator for New Jersey. You can also call GATS anytime. They're very helpful. They pick up very quickly, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Uh, New Jersey Clean Energy is open 9 to 6 um, so I'm guessing the T-Rec administrator, the person who's physically cutting you guys the check is also open nine to six. Um, however, I will, I will check up on that. And if you find something different, you can let me know. Um, but from what I heard, as long as you enter it before the 15th, you get paid the following month, which may be, you know, a month and a half later, the, the end of the, the end of the following month. Um, and then all you do is click the save button right here. I'm not going to click the save button right now because I don't know what your current usage is. But it is uh, super simple and feel free to watch this video over and, and play it in slow motion or pause it or rewind it or whatever. And um, I, I, I hope this is helpful and, and I, I will definitely stop by. Um, I'm definitely in Morristown on Tuesdays, um, but I'm sure I'll have an appointment in your neighborhood and uh, always happy to take your phone call and your texts. And um, yeah, I mean, it sh should be very simple and self-explanatory. You just go back and forth between this website and the Solar Edge application that it seems like Carl is um, very good at using. So um, yeah, super simple. And uh, let me know what else I can do. All right. Bye, guys. Thank you.